Hi, I'm Caleb. Today I'm going to show you how to add a blog and blog posts to your Wix website. So first we need to add the app, the, the blogging app. So in your dashboard, you can go head down to apps right here. And then click get more apps. You can search that Wix has all kinds of apps. We're going to look for the Wix blog. And this is first one. There's other options as well. This one though is built by Wix. It's generally the easiest to use. So click the blue add button. Cool, it's added. Let's go ahead and set it up. So we can leave myself as the author name. You can, I know it's hard to see without hovering over it. Just, just white if you don't hover over it. So let's choose an image real quick for my author profile. Click the replace button with these arrows. I already added this nice picture. I use it for basically everything that I need to look professional for. So we've added, we've, this is just the basic blog setup. It comes with these three um, placeholder blogs. Let's go ahead and delete all those. So I checked. I checked this box to select all, then move the trash over here. Yes, we want to move the trash. Okay, now we can create a new post. So let's make something up. This is my blog post. If you ever need filler text, I like this website, hipsum.co. It's basically lorem ipsum text, but with a bunch of hipster words. Playing book, cornhole, church key, Pinterest, etc. Which is kind of fun. All right. So before we want to publish any post, we need to do a handful of things. First, let's go on the left-hand sidebar. You can click settings and add a cover image. It's a cover photo for your blog post. So I chose this image I would use for a previous video, just for anything. Now you can choose the publish date. If you wrote something a year ago, then you could go all the way back to whatever date. You can choose, choose with which author, if you have multiple authors, right? So if you have somebody publishing a blog post for you, they can choose you as the author. The excerpt is going to go below the below the title and cover image on your website blog page. So it can be usually it's just something catchy that would grab people's attention, right? A uh, great blog post. If you have one post that you really like, you can set it as the featured image and that'll show at the top of your blog permanently. So say and you can also add it to different parts of your website. Let's make it the featured image. One of the main reasons people blog is to get traffic to their website, right? So product or services. What this really is, this is the meta tag and this is the meta description. And that's just what shows on search engines when people are searching for your website. So we can change the description to whatever we want. It'll only display a certain number of characters. But for now it's just something like, check out my blog post. It is actually important to spend some time doing this properly though, because this is what people will see when they're looking for your content. Okay, next we're gonna add it to a category. So these are like product collections in Wix. Categories are different categories for your blog posts, right? So maybe you have, this is a clothing website, right? So maybe it's fashion tips. And then there's another one that's Something like lifestyle and maybe something like travel. You get the idea. You can also add it to multiple categories, by the way. We'll just leave it on fashion tips for now. Okay. So we have cover image, publish date, author, an excerpt. We have some information for SEO. We've added it to a category and we can publish it. Okay. So we've published one blog post. Now let's actually set up our blog in the Wix editor. So we're going to edit the site. That'll take us to the Wix website editor. Once we make it to the, make it into the Wix website editor, on the left-hand column, you'll see a little pin icon. This is where we can add a blog. And so it'll tell you a little bit of information about starting a blog. Let's press the big blue add now button. So you can also add a Wix blog in members area, right? 
where you could have like it's like a little forum, kind of like a mini social networking site. For now, let's add a basic blog. There we go. So at the top, you can see our different categories. Our first blog post has already been added. This is that one that we just made. And in the future, all other blog posts will be added to this page underneath this one, right? You can see the avatar that we said earlier with the author name. You can track views and comments. So let's add our new blog page to our menu by clicking on our menu and then clicking manage menu and then adding an item. We're going to add that page blog. Let's move it up just so it's easy to find here in a minute. Here it is. Now let's publish. View the left side. So here's our blog, I'm ready to start bringing in traffic from search engines and social media. So we can click on the blog post to see the full blog post. Right? By default, Wix's looks pretty good. Visitors can like them. They can also share them using these links. And you can see the total number of views. Visitors can also make a profile and leave comments. And you can get a little bit of interaction that way. Pretty easy, right? It doesn't even take 10 minutes to set up a blog on Wix.